Let's simplify the fraction 28 over 100. And here's how we do it. What we're trying to do is find another fraction that's equivalent to 28 divided by 100. It has the same decimal value, just that we've simplified or reduced it down to the lowest terms. So 28 and 100, they're both even. Probably easiest just to divide both by 2. 28 divided by 2, that's 14. 100 divided by 2 is 50. So we've simplified it down to 14 over 50, but that's also even. Both of these are even numbers. So let's divide by 2 again. 14 divided by 2 is 7. 50 divided by 2 is 25. And we can't reduce 7 25ths any further. It's in lowest terms. So in answer to our question, when we simplify the fraction 28 one hundredths, we end up with 7 25ths in lowest terms. These are all equivalent fractions. If you divide 28 by 100, 14 by 50, or 7 by 25, you get the same decimal answer. It's just that 7 25ths, that is the lowest terms. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.